Hi guys, Luna here and welcome to this Starfield video. In this one, let's take a look at the 10 best starting skills to get early for an all-round build in-game with a mixture of survivability and exploration skills that don't really focus on one specific thing. The first and probably one of the most important skills to unlock is fitness. Being fit is incredibly important in Starfield, maybe even the most important skill, and this matters a lot because the game is all about exploring and you'll do a lot of walking since there aren't any vehicles. The problem is that running uses up a lot of your air you breathe in the game, but the fitness skill will help with that. When you first start, the first three skill levels of fitness help you breathe better, but getting to rank 4 is even better, and at rank 4 fitness makes it so that you can run or do powerful attacks, and you use up less air. This means you will have more air to breathe and you won't run out so quickly. Number 2 is weightlifting. Another important skill, which is part of the physical tree branch, and in Starfield, you will find a lot of stuff, and you need space to carry it. If you carry too much, you'll move slower, and it'll be hard to explore and travel quickly. As you get better at weightlifting, you can carry more things, and when you reach rank 4, you can carry a maximum of 100 kilograms of stuff, and you'll also be more resistant to getting pushed around when hit. Three is weapon proficiency, and there are a lot of fighting in Starfield, and so you will have to upgrade one of your weapon skills. It doesn't matter which one you choose, so long as you use the one that will affect the type of weapon that you are using. So guns, dueling weapons, you get laser weapons, pistols, shotguns, whatever you want to upgrade, make sure to just choose the one that focuses on the type of weapon that you like to use. And early in the game, you should just focus on one weapon type, because each of the weapons have their own strengths, but personally, pistols and lasers are probably the best place to start. Next we have commerce. Money called credits in-game is really important. You need credits to buy ships, supplies and other things. You'll often trade with merchants, so being good at commerce is helpful. Having a high commerce skill makes things cheaper when you buy from vendors and you get more money when you sell stuff as well. At rank 4, things you can buy will cost 20% less, and you'll get 25% more money when you sell things. It's smart to upgrade this skill early in-game. Next up we have Security. There are many locked doors and containers in Starfield, and even though not everything behind these doors is super valuable, it's very useful to still unlock them. The Security skill will help you to hack into locks and make it easier to play hacking minigames. As you level up the skill, you can unlock tougher locks and get better at hacking. This lets you open more doors and containers, even the ones that are harder to crack. Next we have scavenging, and you need credits and supplies like ammo and med packs in game, and scavenging will help you get more of that. So scavenging is about finding better loot, increasing your chances of getting more credits, ammo and healing items. At rank 1 you'll find extra credits, rank 2 you'll find more ammo, and rank 3 you'll discover more healing items, so it's definitely one of the best ones to unlock. Next we have boost pack training. Learning how to use the boost pack is really important, it helps you avoid taking damage when falling and makes climbing easier as well, and it's very useful in combat. And when you improve this skill, your boost pack uses less fuel and refills faster, and at rank 4 the benefits you get are from ranks 2 and 3 are doubled, making your boost pack even more useful. So it's another one that you should get very early. Surveying is getting information about planets, including plants, animals and resources. The surveying skill makes your hand scanner better by letting you zoom in and scan things from further away. When you reach rank 4, you can zoom in 4 times and scan from a distance of 50 meters, and this will help you with getting more resources and gather information about planets once you've landed on them a lot easier. Next we have piloting. Even though you won't travel through space all the time, because there's things like fast travel, being good at flying ships is really important. As you level up in piloting, you'll make your ships easier to control. At ranks 1 and 2, your ship become more manoeuvrable. When you reach ranks 3 and 4, you'll be able to use really good ships. So it's a good idea to unlock the piloting skill early, so you can get the best ships available from earlier in the game. Last but not least, guys, we have medicine. And one of the things, unless you're playing on the very easiest difficulty, you will need a lot of in-game is medicine. Simply, the medicine skill will make healing items work better. With each rank, your healing items will work faster and heal more. In rank 4, you might even be able to use healing items without consuming them as well. So guys, that's it for this one. Just a quick video on the 10 best skills to unlock early for an all-round build. And then once you have more skills, you can start to focus on more specific things as well. But if you want to see more, like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.